first cut right through. Grizzly? Oh yeah. I mean, it's a little weird, I guess. Got a little ginger, salt, olive oil, right? That's it. It's getting a little color. What we're going to do is change it. That will come out, and then the hair fly and the shrimp will go over. Oh, oh. Oh. Is that a shrimp head? Yep. What does that do? Add another layer. Getting some really good cinematic footage right here. Look at that. All the essence of the shrimp being extracted. Yep. Not, not too much. Yeah. Oh my gosh, the footage is amazing. Tomato paste. I'm not really going to taste it, but it just... You know, Thickens it. It gives it color, it gives it a little bit of depth. Mm -hmm. Then you reintegrate the fish. Tog. The tog. Oh, look at that cheek meat right there. Yeah. Oh! There you go. This pan is not hot enough. The stove I gotta cook on. Yeah. Like it keeps cutting in and out. Just very expensive sake. Oh yeah. But we're, we're a few minutes away from that. So. Look at all that that font. On the font, yeah. You know, it's like right on the edge of being burned. Mm -hmm. it's not quite burned yet. That's, that's what you want it to play. Big play. Oh yeah. Whew. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Left a little shot in here. And you just scrape it. But you see how the boil went away? Yep. You know, this not not as hot as you would want it. Typically a hot stove would Yeah, you want it really hot. The heat. I mean it just cuts down on time. Right? Yeah. It keeps everything fresher. Alcohol is pretty much done. Mm-hmm. At this time. Good. Now This is really, most of the stock is going to be like this right now. Yeah. And then we're just going to, you know, not gently simmer, but pretty rapid boil. 20, 25 minutes, that's it. And then we strain it. Why do you, why do you rapid boil? 
just to keep it fresh. Oh, okay. I, I found, you know, if you, if you gently simmer like the traditional French way, the fish, it just, it just ends up being pretty muddy, the right. flavors. That's my opinion. But the point of boiling for, instead of simmering from 25 minutes is to get all the flavor? Yeah, you um, know, there's a lot of gelatin in blackfish. Oh, so you want to break it down. Yeah, you want to break it down. Mm -hmm. And the real reason you, you gently simmer stock is you want a clear stock. You know, mm -hmm. like you want a crystal clear stock at the end. Pull this to one side. Oops. So what's what is in the skin like the foam? It's just you know it's like like the the the, the breakdown like, of the blackfish, the fat, yeah, the solids. It's, it's like protein, there's oh, some right. blood, you know, whatever you know what the French call the impurities. Mm -hmm. stock or a clear soup, you wouldn't push. You would right. just let gravity do the work. Oh, and okay. you wouldn't be following it either. Mm -hmm. uh, gentle summer. Oh, man, this soup stock really thickened because the blackfish bones on that gelatin. Now that's kelp, mm -hmm. Korean kelp. Not the highest quality, but it'll work. What's the highest quality? I don't know, probably Japanese. Mm -hmm. I don't know what makes one better than another, it's just... Oh, so you're doing the dashi straight in the stock? Yeah. Rather than putting in I've the... tried making dashi, mm -hmm. and then using the dashi to make the seafood stock. It, yeah. it doesn't work out. Do it the other way around. Yeah. Make the seafood this stock. This way is better because you're yeah. not really cooking the dash in that far. Right. Now usually you start the kombu in cold water, mm -hmm. in cold stock, and bring it up, but we don't have time for that today. Mm -hmm. the stock's already So hot. normally if you had all the time in the world, you would chill the stock first. Right. Yeah. If you, yeah. That, that would never happen. And just rough strain this and then we're going to mm -hmm. fine strain. Fish. Yeah, this is basically the stock, yeah. the soup, the broth, ready to go. Mm -hmm. And you just have to season the taste. Adding that as like a bed for the for the, the tog. Yeah. yeah. It's you know it adds flavor, but also this way guarantee won't stick. Mm -hmm. 
So this is the place. the bottom side. The presentation side is on the other side. Mm -hmm. And for fish, usually presentation side is the bone side of the fillet, mm -hmm. and the off side is the um, is the skin side. And um, lime juice, mm -hmm. sugar, mirin, and it's just a taste, a little soy, soy sauce in there too. And the same is going to go on the shrimp. Mm. Oh, that noodles look good. Yeah, I, I actually prefer this. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. Ramen is good if it's really good ramen. Mm -hmm. but. Layler. Layle, yeah. Just slowing him down. In goes the Inoki. Oh yeah. Good portion. Oh yeah. Oh man. That looks good.